I'm Randy Pick with the Reynolds Journalism Institute. In December 2020, RJI teamed with the National Association of Broadcasters and research firm Smith Geiger to conduct a national survey about the vaccine rollout. In this video, we're going to talk about two questions the survey asked regarding news coverage. To provide insight, I'm joined by Monique Luisi, a professor and researcher at the Missouri School of Journalism who helped on this project. Hi, Monique. Hi, Randy. Okay, let's get started. Our first question, what kinds of vaccine-related stories would you want to see? Monique, what did we learn? There are many different ways that the news can talk about the coronavirus vaccine, but the participants were clear. They really want to see stories about how the vaccine affects infection rates. And they also want to know about how the vaccine will affect them physically. Also important, people wanted to see stories that included fact checks and misinformation about the vaccine so that they knew the real facts. Less helpful, however, were stories that had explanatory science about the vaccine and details about how the vaccine is given. In the end, people want information, facts. They want to know how the vaccine will affect their communities, and they don't want to be preached to. In a related question, we asked what types of stories will encourage their trust in the content about the vaccine? Monique? So when it comes to trust, the best approach is to have stories that talk about vaccine safety that and vaccine effectiveness. Also stories that included recommendations for mask wearing were very important. Less influential were stories that have an editorials that talked about getting vaccinated or featured people getting vaccinated. So again, people want to know the facts. They want to know that the vaccine is safe and effective. They want recommendations for mask wearing, but that's as far as they want people to go and not have editorials. Thank you, Monique. You can find these results and more online in the vaccine rollout kit that was put together by NAB. Thanks for watching.